Hello you lovely people. Welcome back to my channel. For a hidden gem video guys. Yeah. We're there again guys. Another hidden gem. And this one was on the SNES. The fantastic beautiful bloody machine by Nintendo back in the day guys. And we're looking at a fantastic platformer. Gorgeous beyond belief. The most fantastic oh, music ever. Really, really fantastic music, guys. Um, this is a little gem of a uh, game. Never really made it to anything else either. Just onto the Super Nintendo, guys. Um, it was released by Software Creations from Manchester here in the UK. Um, Steve and John Pickford were the concept behind it. They they thought of the concept, guys. Absolutely fan-bloody-tastic brothers, uh, Steve and John Pickford. Oh, famous in the video games world, of course, especially here in Blighty. Yeah, this is a little stunner, guys. Originally released uh, in 1993. So uh, it was in um, September in North America. It was in November in Japan. And then finally, strangely, considering it was a British company with a couple of British guys having the concept and everything, not till to this December '93, guys. Here in uh, well, Europe as such, and here in Blighty for sure. Very, very odd that one, but um, yeah, what a fantastic bloody platformer this is, guys. It is called Plock. Simple as that, Plock. Um, very, very, very. Oh, nice mechanics to this game, guys. Where you can somersault around and just jump. You can shoot. You collect shells. Oh my God. It is a gorgeous flipping platformer. Oh, it really is. I mean, there, there were some stunning platformers on the uh, Super Nintendo, guys. On the NES, there were some absolute doozies. And this is no exception to the rule, guys. But it's just not talked about anymore. Why or oh why or oh why, I don't know. Why there wasn't a massive bloody spin-off franchise from this, I do not know either. Because it's fantastic. I mean, having the Pickford brothers behind it, that shows you already. They came up with the concept, guys. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Um, so yes, guys, shall we take a look at what is really a British platformer? Obviously, you know, Software Creations and the Pickford brothers. What more could you possibly want? So yes, guys, why don't you join me as we take a look at this gorgeous flipping platformer? That was on the SNES back in 1993, guys. Oh, it's a doozy. See you in a sec. Right, here we go, guys. We'll look at Plock. That hidden gem on the SNES. That's fantastic, that bit. Here we go, guys, with a bit of a demo. Here it also uh, tells you your control guys, obviously. What a fantastic looking game sound and wow.
Oh, isn't it a pretty awesome gun? And there's your credits already. Yeah, there you go, look, John and Steve Pickford, the Pickford brothers. Fantastic British uh, flipping designers, guys, it's absolutely awesome. Right, let's play this thing, shall we? Hmm, this is where we're going then, then. Right, here we go, the first level rise. You see, you can do that. Some assault, whatever they're calling it. And then of course you can. Who's those guys? Oh well, I would have if I would have uh, not left it too long. Ah, you gotta jump away from those guys. You can just do a normal jump as well, like that. Oh, you bugger. Away. <laughs> oh, yes. They're not as <laughs> not quite as uh, yeah fantastic as the old demo there, was it? But at least we did it. Hey, this isn't my flag. <laughs> Wicked. You know, it's a pair of pants. Right, here we go. On the second level, guys. Coming for us, they're coming. I'm just gonna go out of the way a minute. Oh, until you do that, of course. Oh, hey, look at all the enemies. This is a bit silly. Oh, hey. What happened? Ah. Haha, <laughs> I'm turning into a little superhero. Look. Wicked. I bet the bloody logs can still get you there. You're almost guaranteed, aren't you? Does it mean I'm uh, invincible for a while? No, 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 it's a bit like it. No, I'm not invincible. Don't try that again. Huh. 
Hmm. Oh, have I lost it now? No. Oh, I've lost my superpowers. Oh wow. Oh, this is fabulous going on, so really. Watch out for him, don't we? I see how uh, people refer to this as being a bit like Rain Man, where he's shooting his hands around and stuff. Oh, fuck, I bloody love that right now. I'm there, I'm there. Ooh. What's going on? That's not your flag, that's a scarf. Where to now, Plock? You can see how fabulous this bloody game is, guys. Gorgeous. Sodding game really is. So cute yet hard at the same time. Ah, and then you took that little bit. And then you got to get away from him. He's bloody sharp, he should just follow you. So get out of the way quick. Now, if you go down here, you will land in the water, but I'll show you guys. But it bounces you back up, but don't do it twice, because you, you'll be dead. Until so I just showed you it too. To uh, show you yeah. what happens if you fall down there. Yeah, bloody logs everywhere. You can you can kill them. Oh, we got me though. I'm yeah, sure you can kill them, guys. You just stay away long enough to do it. That's it, but we got him. And it turns into a great big bloody jewel. You can do that with all of them. We can do it again. No, he got us again. Alright, well, so we're not going to do that again, guys. I've shown you now what, what happens if you do kill one. But to be quite honest, I don't want to die. Unnecessarily, shall we say. Oh, there we go again. Oh, you got me already. Right, I've got to be much more careful now, guys. Much more careful. Well, hey, you're not going to jump down here again. Let's get to the engine hall. That's it. That's better. Can we do another one here? Yeah, get away from him quick. Good. I want you to go down here, is it? Yeah. Well, hey, look at that. Wow. Wicked. Which way do we go now, though? Hmm. Doesn't allow like we have much choice, does it? Way into the bloody water, though. Oh. Hmm. Very interesting. Aha! So we're supposed to jump, are we? Yeah. So it appears so... Oh dear. Let's try again. Oh yeah, bugger. I'm trying to just get through it quick, so... Yeah. Don't try that. You just die. Oh, he got me again. And it's literally game over, guys. No, no, we're going to see. Where do you start again then? Right back at the beginning. Got to let that play, guys. <laughs> it's awesome. Right, here we go. Again. Yeah, back to the beginning, guys, but... That's okay though. Whatever. Skip through it all.
Oh yeah, there's another stair on there. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, buggers. Do you think they got me? I think so. Well, there we go, we're at the uh, end of the first level again. Superhero thing again, are we? <laughs> oh, yes, look at that. Wicked. Of course, we know it doesn't protect us completely. No, that would have been too much to expect. Fish can still get on us. Oh, that's still got me more. I could get them damn shells there. Oh, look, we lost it already. Doesn't last very long, but you know, there's something in it. Not too sure how much it protects you, though. There seems to be a lot, doesn't it? Hey, hey. did that in good time. Isn't this a fantastic game, guys? It really is. Absolutely fantastic. Here we go again. See if we do it better this time with this level. Oh, you bugger, there he is again. Good stinker. I don't want to I would like to have killed him, but yeah. He just missed too much by from there. Yeah. If I can get this one. No, even that one. See, like, I did try. Let's just get away from him as much as possible. Oh, we better. I didn't want to get away from you, though. Too busy concentrating on those sods. Horrible thing, man. Oh, I don't know. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, there's another one. Yeah. Yes, got him. And of course, it tells us to go down here, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. The fake, bloody checkpoints. Oh, you git! Oh. It seems like that first one, you've got no way of avoiding it, yeah. There goes the other one, right? yeah, there he goes again, you've got me again. Yes. I'm just trying to jump over things to get back to where we were, really. Oh, you bugger. Look at that. Oh, dearie me, eh? Oh, stop it. Whoa, what the hell? 
Back in there, bounce, plunk, bounce. I mean, I can kill him with a bounce. No, it doesn't, that's not fair. Oh well. Oh. Yeah, not doing very well, guys, on as usual. You expect it, though. I'm just going to sneak a little toad to do that. Get him, get him, get him! Oh! God, I so wish I could get him, guys, but you very rarely do. It would be a constant jumping up and down, wouldn't it? But you know what, guys? Let's end with a song. Just, just fantastic, guys. Um, yep, back with my final thoughts. Mm, isn't that fantastic, guys? Oh, the music by John Buckley is fantastic. I mean, he is infamously brilliant in the video game industry. And, uh, oh, Leiden... Brooks guys doing the graphics uh, as I said obviously the Pickford Brothers did the concept yeah oh oh what an awesome bloody game guys and uh, you know I would love to see something like that on the Evercade guys makes you wonder if they could get some sort of deal on that one wouldn't that be fantastic on that little handheld guys it would be beautiful on there um yeah what a stunning bloody game the all oh, the mechanics of it are so fantastic yeah, it gets a bit tough, doesn't it? And how much is that like Rayman in a way? What with chucking your limbs around and things? Um, it does make you wonder, doesn't it? Um, if somebody got an idea from somebody there, you know. Uh, yeah, fantastic, fantastic game. And like I said, guys, like so many of these games, that get buried in time. It's such a shame and they need to be pushed forward. And that is the reason why I do these Hidden Gem video, guys. Because a game like that, should not be buried in time is extremely fun for us all these and for the young ones guys maybe discovering it for the first time but did you know of this game's existence guys i know it's out there on the tube um on other hidden gem videos obviously um but oh my god i remember it when it came out guys i absolutely loved it then i still love it now it's in my collection as a loose cart, unfortunately, not boxed. Um, you know, one day maybe I'll get a box copy of it because, honest to God, it is a beautiful platformer. And uh, it deserves shelf space on anybody's bloody snare shelf. Um, but yeah, what did you think of it? Again, comment below, guys. What did you think of this? Do you think it's a stunner? Do you think it should make a reappearance on the uh, Evercade, guys, by Blaze? I think it would be perfect. Maybe... There was enough decent bloody games there for uh, there to be a cartridge. As such, you know, a, an absolute doozy of a cartridge from Software Creations. I mean, I don't know how possible that is these days. Obviously, they don't exist anymore. Um, I, like I said, they were a Manchester-based company, an English company. And yeah, unfortunately, like so many of them back in the day, they don't exist anymore, which is a great bloody shame. But it makes you wonder who owns the license to these games now that they created. Maybe there could be a cartridge from that. That would be an interesting thing. Hmm. I might have to look into that, guys, and see exactly what they did create. Um, because, you know, it's a company that, again, it's lost in time, guys. You say that name to people these days and they'll be like, what, who? Software Creations? Who the hell are they? Unless... You're a die-hard, bloody retro fan, like us, I should think. Most of you out there certainly are. Otherwise, you wouldn't be here, would you? Of course, you're going to be a bloody retro fan, and you probably have heard of them. Um, but again, oh, what a fantastic, fantastic Pickford Brothers creation that was. Well, they certainly came up with the concept anyway. But yeah, fantastic, guys. Um, as I said, comment below, what do you think? Do you think a beautiful little platformer like this should make a reappearance on something like the Evercade, guys? Because I certainly do. I'm sure it's made appearances somewhere, no doubt. Uh, you know, something's eluding me here. And, uh, 
you know maybe it's been put onto some compilation of some kind i don't know i really don't um but it certainly had you know fantasticness to it such fantasticness to it that it deserves and i say deserves to be on the evercade because the game has to be quite stellar to be on that little beauty i'll tell you that and that one certainly is stellar in my opinion but you might think completely different and if you do you know what to do comment below guys so there we go again another hidden gem video guys only the one title this time but what a beautiful one it is and with that guys i'm just going to say the usuals if you're not subbed already please drop me a sub give me a funny thumbs up and don't forget to tap that bell icon to get the notifications and then tap the all icon to make doubly sure and with that guys i'm going to love you and leave you again and i'll see you in the next one bye bye guys see you soon